So it says that the average monthly salary of all the employees in an industry is 12,000. So the average salary of all the employees is 12,000 and that of the male employee is 15,000 and of female employee is 8,000. We have to find out the ratio of male employees to female employees. So we'll try to solve this question by two methods. So first we'll try to see the normal method. So for that, let's suppose the number of males number of males b m and females in the industry b f now we know that the average salary of male employees is 15000 so the total amount of money that male employees are getting is the average salary into the number of male employees so this is the total salary that male employees are getting plus the salary which is uh, the salary which female employees are getting is the average salary of female employees and the number of female employees. So this is the total salary that all the people are getting. 15,000 uh, M into 8,000 F. Now we know that this total salary is equal to the average salary of the industry that is 12,000 F. 12,000. This is the average salary of the industry into the number of people in the industry and number of people in the industry are males plus females so 15000 m plus 8000 f is equal to the 12000 into m plus f so we'll solve for this so this is 15000 m plus 8000 f this is equal to 12000 m plus 12 thousand f now um, 12,000 m will bring it over here so it becomes 3,000 m and 8,000 f will take it over here so 12,000 f minus 8,000 f it becomes 4,000 f so this 3 0 will get cancelled and we can calculate the ratio of m upon f is equal to 4 upon 3 so we have to find out the question says that what is the ratio of male employees to female employees so the ratio that's what we have find out is 4 is to 3 of male employees to female employees now so this is a usual method now as we have seen in the mixture allegation chapter there is a concept that suppose this is a number line uh, females are over here and males are over here. Now females are getting the salary 8000 and this is the number line which is represented over here and males are getting 15,000 salary. Now the average between them lies somewhere over here. This is 12,000. So we know that the number of employees over here that is M is directly proportional to the this distance that is M is directly proportional to this eight distance between 8000 and 12000 that is 4000 and this f is directly proportional the number of employees over here is directly proportional to this distance that is f is proportional to this 12000 minus 15000 minus 12000 that is 3000 so m upon f what we get is 4 upon 3 so this is a shortcut method we can use so the ratio comes out to be the same 4 upon 3 of male employees to female employees in the industry.